materialistic world, there are several practical situations where we need to react instantaneously and do not get enough time to use buddhi and analyze and react. Question is, initially, how do we handle this situation till we do tapas to empower buddhi? What buddhi is there, whether it is extremely powerful or not much powerful, we have buddhi with us. Now. Whatever little we can apply in that situation, we have to apply. There is no other way. You are telling me that you are helpless, which I don't agree. You see, and instantaneously, nobody, you don't need to, you can get one second. Now. So ask, what is the consequence? Ask this one. What is the consequence? Then ask one more question. What do I need to do now? What can I do now? These three questions will take exactly 1.3 seconds. At least this you have to ask before you take decisions. Otherwise, we are blindly running through an alley and uh, the cost of the decision would far supersede the cost or the delayed cost of the decision. <laughs> when you delay something for a few seconds, there is a cost for that. Na? If you blindly do that, I think the cost of that decision is far more than a few seconds delay of uh, you know giving a decision. Many times, remember one thing, somebody else's delay does not make it urgent for you. Uh, they have to take some responsibility also. This I learned it on the third day of my whirlpool days when I when the project was in a big cheer party and some stuff has to be signed. There was this 50-year-old person uh, and uh, he was a draftsman, see, and a pakka person. I came running and said, sir, I need approval right now. I need it in five minutes. You know what he said? He just stayed back and said, Ram, your delay is not my urgency. Keep it on the table. Dinner. I felt really mad. But then I reflected and said, what a lesson I learned today. You see, Why should I make somebody else's delay my urgency? Then I will do the same mistake as that person. Some things have to be crisis managed, no problem. But uh, I need to first uh, be convinced that uh, it is really, really important and urgent and I need to make the decision right now. Many times, I force myself to think it's a quick decision. See? Most often than not, I don't think we need to make instantaneous decisions. Instantaneously, what we do is called a reaction. You see, it's an instinct. A snake comes, you can't use your buddhi. How big is the snake? How deep is the fang? Is this the snake which my teacher told me? But then when we do that, it's out of instinct. You see? So always pause and ask these three questions if you can. If I decide this, what is the consequence? Snap decision. Huh? Take a fractal and see. What can I do now? What do I need to do now? Ask these three questions. You will be a different person overnight. I assure you. Ask these three questions. Take that 1.3 seconds. As long as it's not a snake. You see, ask these three questions. Because it's a snake, thankfully, Bhagavan does all the thinking inside. <laughs> <What are? laughs> so these three questions need to be done. This is what is called responding to crisis. When you respond, you are clear on three things. That I can take a decision. I shall take a decision. This is the consequence of the decision. And these are the possibilities available to me right now. And this is the actual need which will narrow down the possibility to an action. All this I've told you so much, na? that takes only 1.5 seconds, three questions. What is the consequence? I take a decision, what is the consequence? You can immediately get a hit. Na? Second, what can I do given the situation now? Ask yourself that. Third, what do I need to do so that it is in line with purpose? You can ask this question, what can I do? See, half a second. If it is in the mind, even faster. What do I need to do? What is the consequence? Ask this. Otherwise, buddhi will never be empowered. These are the situations which help us to empower buddhi. You can't do it offline. This is on the job training. You see, you've got to empower it that way. It's not as difficult as you think it is, I think. And of course, time, energy, attention, maybe for big patients you can take. For small patients, you don't need that. <laughs>